All right, yo, what's good everyone? Nick Smith is back. Welcome to a new rebuild video today. It's gonna be a little bit different. We're gonna be doing something um, that is kind of what I do, but a little bit of a different thing. And uh, me and Agent Zero, he uh, he came up with this idea. Pretty amazing idea. Um, I'm surprised that no one's done this yet. Well, from what I know, no one's done this. But pretty much what you do is you choose, well, he chooses the team. And we go into a series called the Rebuild Battles. And the Rebuild Battles is where we have to rebuild the team. There's two, par there's two parts to this. You've got to rebuild the team. And, you know, obviously see how far you can go into, uh, into you know, the season. See if you can win the championship or how far you can go into the playoffs or if you even make it to the playoffs. Um, yeah, so see how far you go in part one with all the trades and, and things that you make. And part two is where we face off against each other with the trades and the teams that we make. So... That'll be dope. And the team that we're doing next is the Atlanta Hawks, which is actually pretty amazing. He came up to me with the idea, right? He said, what team... Like, he, he said... I don't know. He did, like, some computer-generated thing, and the, the team that he chose was the Atlanta Hawks. And it, it, it fits perfectly, because we're up to the Hawks in our series, in the rebuilding series. So, it fits perfectly. We're going to, obviously, we already did the Memphis Grizzlies. Now we're doing the Hawks. And then, in the next one, we're doing the Miami Heat. But, yeah, if you guys are excited for this video, smash the like button. Go over to Agent Zero's channel. Subscribe to his channel. But, yeah, man, let's get uh, let's get into this. The Atlanta Hawks. This team is, uh, you know, I don't want to, I don't want to completely trash this team, right? Uh, but, in saying that, this is a this is an episode where it's a little bit different from my rebuilds because in my rebuilds I try to uh, well it, the draft class doesn't even matter by the way because we only do one season of this um, but I try to keep the main guys on that team on the squad if you know what I mean so like with the uh, with the what's a good example with the Memphis Grizzlies I I tried to keep Marcus Sol um, with the um, with the Boston Celtics, I tried to keep Isaiah Thomas. Uh, with the Cavs, obviously, I tried to keep LeBron Kyrie. But anyway, right here, we are the Atlanta Hawks. And we're looking to make some trades to start out. Um, the team, it's a decent team. It's not bad. They don't have anyone over an 83. So Paul Millsap's obviously the highest rated player. Um, which isn't great. Like, you'd expect this team uh, to be a little bit of a higher... Overall, um, I guess as a team, they got quite a bit of depth. But, I mean, in real life, I think these guys are the third seed, if I'm not mistaken right now, third in the East. So, you know, this team is not a bad team at all. Um, I'm excited for the playoffs to start out, man. But, um, yeah, let's uh, let's start out by going to free agents and just signing some free agents that maybe will help us during, uh, during uh, this season, trying to get some trade value uh, with these players. Now, we got to get rid of someone, so we might as well just make a quick trade instead of, you know, waving one of these players. We might as well just try and get rid of three guys for like two, um, maybe something like this, like this, like this. Um, I, don't, I, don't, I, don't, I don't know. We don't need our first round picks, so we don't need our first round picks. So we might as well just make this trade right. You know what? Can we give you like all of our second round picks that we won't use? 2017 first round pick. Uh, how about a second round pick? I don't like that. How about we give you like a 2019 first round pick? Uh, how about a 2018 first round pick? I guess not. I reckon they want that 27. Actually, do you want the 2017 pick then? Sweet. All right. Quick trade, uh, pretty simple. All we did was gain two plays, which means that we can sign Larry Sanders. Now, Larry Sanders, he won't play with us. He won't play with us. Um, he might, I mean, depends on the injuries, but we have a lot of Sanders now. We got Splitter, Sanders, Olenek, Horford, and Mike Muscala. So, yeah, those are our Sanders. We have a, we have a quite a few uh, Sanders on our roster now. Which means that trades need to happen. And trades need to go down. Um, I, okay, the, the thing is, like, I want to get players that I feel comfortable playing with. Because I'm going to face up against Agent's team that he makes. So, whatever players I get on this team, i got to feel comfortable with playing with them for when I face up against Agent Zero. Um, in saying that, I want to make sure that these players right here are going to be good... Um, so I can win a championship, or at least try to see how far we go in the season. Now, there is one thing I want to do, and I want to go after 
a Wizards first round pick. Now, before you say, but you're only doing one season with this, I know that, okay? I know that. The thing is, um, that wiz the Wizards pick right here, it's going to go up by trade deadline. I will, I, at least I hope so. I think it's going to go up by trade deadline. Um, so, I haven't seen many people go after something like this, but I have a feeling that if I go after some pretty good first round picks, hopefully they go up by trade deadline, which allows me to uh, to maybe make a huge trade at trade deadline with this series. But time to get started with the players that I feel comfortable with. And what's our team chemistry looking like? 48%. We might as well just make all the trades at the start of this season before we... Uh, before we, you know, get into like, um, I don't know, before we get into the season. Hassan Whiteside. I love Hassan Whiteside. I feel comfortable playing with Hassan Whiteside. I can always have this trade in my mind when, I, when I'm when i looking to make some trades. Hassan Whiteside. I mean, we have to give out the Orlando pick. That's okay with me. We get Luel Deng as well. I'm going to make the trade. I'm going to make the trade. I, I feel so comfortable playing with Hassan Whiteside, okay? He's a guy that I feel like when I play with Whiteside, I can go to work. I really like Dennis Schroeder as well. So I'm not, I, like, I can trade Jeff Teague. That's fine with me. Um, Derek Rose, you know, he might be a guy that is so, he, like, he's, he is my guy in 2K. He's a, he's a monster in 2K. And he's rated higher than Jeff Teague. What? I'm going to make this trade. I didn't know he was rated higher than Jeff Teague, so now it's just up to me whether I want Tony Snell or who was the other dude? Justin Holiday. You're a shooting guard and you're a... Yeah, I'll take Tony Snell. And we have to get rid of Thiago Splitter, but we have a lot of centers on this team. Don't need, don't need our Thiago Splitter. So now, good Derek Rose, Kyle Korver, Luel Deng, Millsap, Whiteside, Schroeder, Olenek, Sanders, Scott, Humphreys, Hardaway, Bazemore, Snell, and RJ Hunter. I'll come back to that trade, but I want to see what this dude is worth. Thad Young. I love Thad Young. Millsap. Dang for Thad Young. I don't know. Should I do Dang for Thad Young? I mean, we have to, I don't want to give out that Wizards pick, though, actually. What if we just did this, and I'll give you two second round picks? I don't want to give, I don't want to give out that Wizards pick, though. That's the annoying thing. Um, I mean, we'll, we'll give you Olenek, if you want Olenek. And I'll take um, Thomas Robinson. You want Kent Bazemore? I don't want to give up Kent Bazemore, though. Kent Bazemore is good. Um, we'll give you, like, freaking uh, Mike Scott. You want Mike Scott? You can have Mike Scott. And we'll take your worst player. How are you one and a half star? I haven't even... I, I don't even know who that is. All right, Markel Brown. Wow, they agreed to the... We got Thad Young on this team? All right, so now... I don't really know why I got Thad Young, because he... He plays power forward, but... I'll take it, I guess. He might be a guy that maybe gets the boot. But um, we'll simulate till around here. Simulate to here. Great job. You managed to get injured in the first game. Wow. Good job, buddy. Uh, okay, so that's the annoying part. We got injuries that we got to deal with. Uh, Richardson and Gerald. Gerald Green is a guy that's a monster in 2K. Like... You don't even understand. And Josh Richardson, he has a 91 shot three, but that is not Josh Richardson in my team. So, I will do this though. Straight up. Straight up. That's 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 fair, right? That's I Brian Weber's a beast. He he looks sick. He has like cornrows, I think. I like Brian Weber, but like I don't know if I want him. You can have Markel Brown. You want Markel Brown? We'll give you Markel Brown. I'll take Weber for Markel Brown. I don't want to give up Tim Hardaway. How good it Oh, he went down. He used to have a crazy shot three. Tim Hardaway Jr. went. I I'll take this. We all know. We all know how good Gerald Green is in 2K. Let's be honest. Let's be honest. Okay. We all know how, how good uh, Gerald Green is in 2K. So yeah, I, I, I like that trade. Let's keep simulating. Uh, yeah, we'll adjust the rotation. Uh, okay, simulate through date. We're one and zero so far. We lose to the Knicks. We beat the Hornets and then lose and then beat the Heat. Lose to the Nets. Kent Bazemore's back, which is awesome. I forgot to do the rotation, so let's do the rotation. Okay. And let's keep... Actually, you know, we'll simulate to, like, the All-Star game, I guess. Like, we don't... We're 6-3. We're, we're That's the annoying part. He's gonna be injured. We'll have the CPU adjust the rotation. Oh. You're back. 
Okay. That's not like the Derrick Rose that I know, but, um, yeah, he was back early, and we're doing work right now. Derrick Rose, buddy. Buddy. Can you not, can you not be injured just for, like, this dude, he gets injured, comes back the next game. I don't know. He's done that twice now, but, uh, we'll have a CPU. We're going on a crazy winning streak. Uh, we lose to the Cavs. Beat the Celtics. Lose to the Minnesota Timberwolves. Beat the Memphis Grizzlies. Lose to the Spurs. Beat the Thunder. We are... We're on fire right now, people. We are on fire. Dennis Schroeder's getting injured, which is not great, but it's okay because he's. These injuries are so so. I'm. They they're doing all these little injuries, and then they're gonna make me like get a huge injury like halfway through the season. Like Hassan Weiss is gonna be out for the season, something like that. It's gonna be crazy, but yeah. Hopefully injuries do not ruin this series because that'll be annoying. Because right now we're 19 and nine. I'm guessing we're first, second. All third in our conference. I mean, we've got the Cavs, the Raptors, the Heat. Um, so, yeah. I mean, I don't know. But, yeah. How you guys been? How you guys been? And, by the way, if you're enjoying this episode right now, smash the like button. Subscribe if you're new. And, obvi and ov obviously, I don't know why I spoke like that, but whatever. And, uh, obviously, go to Agent's channel. See how he did. See the trades that he made. And see what his team looks like. Because we're going to face up against each other. Derek Rose, this dude always gets injured day to day and then comes back like the next game. I guess not. I guess not. But 25 and 16, that's... Okay, okay. I'll take that. Hassan's healed. Neil and Jones. Mm, nah, I'm good. Decline trade. Derek Rose is back. Awesome. And now we're on a, like, a three, two-game losing streak. Let's go on like a 10-game winning streak like we did at the start of the season because that, that would help, right? Yeah, two-game winning streak right now, up against the Nuggets. Make it three. It's the Nuggets. All right. Three-game winning streak. Let's decline that trade. Probably going to lose, and we do. Beat the Pacers. Let, let's call if we're going to win or lose, all right? Mavericks, lose. Win. 76, we better win this game. Come on now. We better goddamn win the... Bruh. Bruh. You're out for one to two weeks? Uh, we'll this. Yeah, we'll, we'll see if you can deal with that. All right. Magic, we better win back to back. Back to back. Alright, no, that, that's not a that's not a great trade. Bulls, we'll probably lose to the Bulls, um, which we do. And now we're 34 and 21, which is the Yo! How are the Cavs doing so bad? But we are the best. Uh we're doing the best in our in our conference, which is dope. I like that. I like that. Um, standings conference, we're first in the East, which is amazing. And how are the Wizards doing? How are the Heat doing so? They must have injuries or some, something crazy. I don't know. I guess Bosch is out, right? Yeah. Wade, Johnson, and Bosch. I'm guessing they're all out. Let, let's take a look real quick. Um, uh, injury report. So, Davis is out two to four months. Um, Paul Zingas is out, Larry's out, Joe Johnson's out, um, Moutier, Bosch, Chris Paul, there are some, Kawhi, Wade, Schroeder, Bill Wiggins, wow, there are some good players injured right now, and now I'm hoping that this pick went up in value, so let's take a look at a trade right here, Zach Levine. Let's get Zach Levine on this team. Come on. Surely I can make a trade for Zach Levine. I like Zach Levine. He can be our scorer off the bench. Thad Young, a first-round pick, $8 million. All right, we can work with that. You just give us Danny Green. And we'll give you Tyler Johnson. And we got... Ah, oh, we got Zach Levine, people. We got Zach Levine. Freaking Levine. Now, I don't know how Zach Levine's going to run in this lineup. But if we if we move Carl Korver to the small forward, we've got Rose, Levine, Korver, Millsap, Whiteside. Sanders, Bazemore, Green, Green. We, okay. And we got, okay. We got Schroeder injured as well. That is fine with me. We should have made the trade up here, actually, which doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. I don't know. Are we good? Are we good? Do we... Can, I don't know. Are we good to go? Ray Allen, you want to come to the Atlanta Hawks? We, I don't think we can even sign Ray Allen, but um, we might as well try. This is the max we can offer him, and he declines. Can we sign anyone? Um, Nate Robinson, mate. Simbula? 
Boy, oh. He wants a bit though. Come on, Sim. Sim, you want. I want I want to get Simbula, but I don't think I can. We can get Giannis's bro. No way. This is my boy, Jared Cunningham. His stats look really bad here. It's not, it actually doesn't. 76 shot three and a crazy driving dunk, 85 driving dunk. But I promise you, this dude's a monster. He might even sign with us as well. I, yeah, he, he will definitely sign with us. Thank you for coming to this team. We have a lot of uh, a lot of point guards, but that's fine with me. One of these guys got to go. One of these guys got to go. Uh, Green, you're good though. We'll, Bazemore. Bazemore for Toledovic and Humphreys. 1.82. Alright, we can work with that. 1.82. Oh, sorry, we, okay, yeah, we would acquire, okay. So, Buttinger, and then we give up Tony Snell. What about this trade? Okay, I'll, I'll take that. Now, I don't really want to lose Kent Baseball, but I guess we had to for the, for the sake of the trade. And now, I'm happy. Rose, Levine, Corva, Millsap, Whiteside, Toledovic, Sanders, Green, Green, Weber, Buttinger, Cunningham, RJ Hunter, and Schroeder's coming back. Solid rotation. Let's simulate till the end of the season and see how far... Oh, my bad. And see how far we uh, we go. Ro Schroeder's fully healed. CPU can adjust the rotation. And it's time to keep beating teams out here. And uh, hopefully we can finish first um, in our conference. But I don't know if we will. I don't know. Because after these trades... Don't know whether it's a good thing or not, but I tried to get plays that I that I liked, and at the moment it's not looking that great. Okay, two wins back to back, three wins back to back to back, four wins back to back to back to back, five wins back to back to back to back to back. Hopefully that was five. That was pretty good. I'm not gonna lie. Schroeder, why are you getting injured, buddy? Stop getting injured. Now you're gonna make us lose. Uh, Sanders is healed. Awesome. Two. We better beat the Wizards twice. Come on. Okay. Thank you very much. Three wins back to back. Four. I keep saying back to back, but it's yeah, whatever. This might look like a three gate. We beat the Cavs. We're looking good. Like we're second in our conference right now, but we could. What did I say at the start of this video? They they're doing all these little injuries, and then they're gonna make me like get a huge injury like halfway through the season. Like Hassan White is gonna be out for the season, something like that. It's gonna be crazy, but I said guarantee you. We will lose him at the end of the season, and he will be out for, like, the rest of the season. Since we are at the last game of the season, that is the biggest loss that I think I could have had going into the end of the season. He's our best freaking player, so Steph wins the MVP. Jalil wins rookie of the year. Six man goes to, uh, obviously, Brandon Knight. Gobert, defensive player of the year. Most improved to CJ McCallum. Did we get anyone for anything? I'm not expecting anything. Of course, Horford makes the All-NBA second team as we trade him. Um, but whatever. I don't think we got anyone for anything, which is okay. Uh, that's fine with me. Because we we finished with the second seed. And now we're up against the Brooklyn Nets. With Whiteside out for four to six weeks. Are you kidding me? Simulate game. Win game one. Simulate game. Lose game two. Lose game three. Lose game four. Are uh, we allowed to simulate with Simcast? I guess so. Let's simulate with Simcast right here. Let's get this win. And, I mean, we're doing pretty well. I'll take that. We win game... What is this? Game 5, I think? Yo, if Whiteside wasn't injured, we actually might have a chance. But this dude, Whiteside, of course, he had to get injured. And we're about to be eliminated. Or not. Wow, we actually win that game. Simulate... Wait. Yeah, simulate to next game. I still can't believe it's a game freaking seven. Let's simulate game. We won just beating the Nets. So, thank God we beat the freaking Brooklyn Nets. I'm guessing we're going to lose in this series, though. Up against the Cavs, this team is, like, pretty good, if I do say so myself. Uh, LeBron, Kyrie, Love, we're going to be eliminated, all right? We're, we're going to be eliminated. I might as well just simulate round... We are gone. Schroeder broke his nose, so that's even better. Kyle Korver's injured, and he's back. 
and we get eliminated. We get swept. So, yeah, we finish with a record of 49 and 33, and we lost in the second round to the Cleveland Cavaliers, who ended up winning the NBA championship. So, yeah, that is that. That's the wrap up. I hope you guys enjoyed this kind of rebuild. Um, it was a. It, it, I don't know. This team is uh, it's going to be good to play with. I want to I want to face up against Agent Zero's team. I want to see who Agent Zero traded for and what trades he made and how his team did. But yeah, uh, 49 and 33, second round in the playoffs, and now it's time to face off against Agent Zero. So yeah, look out for that video. If you guys enjoyed the video, definitely hit that subscribe button. Leave a like on this video if you guys enjoyed it and you want to see more. The next rebuild will be my type of rebuild, and it will be with my own team, the Miami Heat. So that should be awesome. And definitely go out and check out, that made no sense, but definitely go and check out Agent's channel. Link is in the description, and uh, yeah, see what trades he made. But uh, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. I'm out. Peace.